And a happy softball Sunday to you. Thank you for joining me. Today we've got Hand in My Pocket for Jay Prize and Rob Hawkins. But before anyone puts their hands in anyone's pockets, I hope you don't mind if I take just a moment to thank the following people for signing up for the Patreon Supporter of the Cause Club. Torched Plane 01, George Peckham, I hardly even know him, and Albert Meyer. Guys, thank you very, 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 very much for your support. And if you would like to find out what that's all about, the link, of course, is in the description. So in the verse, the whole verse, all we technically hear is the E string third fret, the B string third fret, and the open G string. So you can just do those three notes if you like. But you'll recognize that as, you know, half of your whole G chord. So if you want to just go ahead and play G, be my guest. Playing with Kermy, yeah. <laughs> That's the whole verse. And what it all comes down to, F, C, is that everything's gonna be G. However, when the band hits F in the song, we hear the persistence of that high G note on the E string third fret, so you might want to play F add nine, which is baby F, plus your pinky finger on the E string third fret. When you switch to C, you can leave that pinky finger, and this chord is still just called C because adding a G to our C chord doesn't change its C-ness. Good thing there's no P chord. We've already got a G note in the open G string. And what it all comes down to, F add nine to C with the G, and then look how easy that change is if I play Tom Petty G, which is three finger G with the wrong fingers, plus now you can reach for the B string first fret with your pointer finger and make a G sus four, which you will recognize. And what it all comes down to, F add nine to C to G, cause I've got F add nine and then quick C D back to the verse. If you want to hearken the harmonica solo, play Tom Petty G and reach for the B string first fret and the G string second fret. Or you can kazoo it. That's that, so go forth and do that. But what would Softball Sunday be without the sharing of an evolution bell comment? It's the evolution bell, the bell that fights back. Today's evolution bell comment comes from Zoso Rover 828 who says, one too many Kermits. <laughs> Fighting words. <laughs> but thank you, sir, for your comment. Ouch. Thank you so much for being here. I've got one hand in my pocket and the other one's holding my clicky button so I can end the video.